Dear friends in the Initiatives for International Dialogue, as Chairperson Emeritus of the International League of People's Struggle and Chief Political Consultant of the National Democratic Front of the Philippines, I wish to convey to you warmest greetings of solidarity as you celebrate the 33rd anniversary of your organization. I salute and congratulate you for all the achievements that you have scored because of your dedication and hard work. Since 1988, you have excelled at sharing with the people of the world the rich experiences of the Filipino people in fighting for their national and democratic rights and defeating the Marcos fascist dictatorship and to carry forward the solidarity extended to us by other peoples and nations. You have been successful at promoting South-South solidarity. You have been able to forge networks, coalitions, and fronts in support of the self-determination struggles of East Timor, Aceh, and West Papua, the democratization of Burma, the end of apartheid in uh, South Africa, and the quest for a durable peace in Sri Lanka, Palestine, and Latin America. At the same time, you have carried out your task in the Philippines as your home base. You have continued to work for the self-determination of both the entire Filipino nation and the indigenous peoples, for democratization and a just peace. The noble duty that you have vowed to perform is more necessary than ever before in the face of the tyranny and state terrorism resulting in the termination of the GRP and the FP peace negotiations since 2017. I hope that you will continue to work for the resumption of the aforesaid peace negotiations, the revival of previous agreements, and overcoming of obstacles to a peace process that has been guided by the Hague Joint Declaration of the GRP and NDFP. Let this be among your major concerns as you are determined to engage in promoting peace and conflict prevention in the Southeast Asian community. I wish the entire IID and all its leaders, interns, colleagues, and teammates to score greater achievements in bridging people and building peace in the coming years. You deserve the support of all peace-loving and justice-seeking institutions and organizations and the broad masses of the people. Long live the Initiatives for International Dialogue.